What's up, guys? I'm Ryan Little, producer, content creator, and fellow spokesman for Pelman Jr. Welcome back. Today, I want to take this video to highlight a pack from Pelman Jr. that actually dropped last month that I've been enjoying a lot recently. And this pack is called Eternal Vibes. And I guess the name kind of fits because, you know, it, it, it's been out for a minute, but I'm still kind of enjoying it. But yeah, the pack is called Eternal Vibes, Pelman Jr. You see, I already have it opened up right here. 12 mini compositions, key labeled, BPM labeled, and you already know we give you the stems. All of them. Check it out. But yeah, I've been enjoying this pack lately because it has that heavenly synth type of feel. I don't know. It has the feeling of the wave. I know it's, a, it's really hard to grasp right now, but when you hear it, I think you'll know what I mean. And let's just get into it. I'm not going to try to do too much explaining. Let's just listen to a few of the samples I have picked out, and we'll kind of go from there. All right, let's check it out. Here's the first one. So yeah, that first one I really like. You can see we even go to the stems here, what it has in it. It has that lovely piano uh, that synth bass is, is hitting perfect within the mix. It has some vocals come in. Actually, the vocals were in basically throughout the entire sample. It has that feel. It just kind of gives you a heavenly feel, man. I'm, I like it. So I think the, the goal of this pack was to really encompass having that synth vibe because you hear it in through all the you know in all of these samples of course the pack is going to have its its real quote-unquote sounds those real instruments with uh, the, the pianos and the basses and uh and you know, so on and so forth but there's it has a really synthy vibe to it throughout this entire pack i don't know but again listen to this next one and you'll see what i mean So you have your second one again lovely vibe so lush what can i say again i think for me that those keys are, are crazy let's let's be clear on that and then how that bass kicks in as well like it, it, it's crazy uh, this this is one of the samples i love the most from this pack i think the sample kind of encompasses what this pack is all about uh, in terms of the feel uh, in terms of how it makes me feel at least um i it, it just kind of makes you get lost in what's being played. You know, you hear this and you kind of just get lost in it. And I think all of these samples do a great job of that. But this last one, I think, would drive the point home, for me at least. And again, like, again, those are real sounds, but it just has like a, I don't, it, it's, and it's the Pillman Jr. processing, obviously, but it's just, it has like, it, it, it's a certain like, synthy feel to me and this is just how, how i feel about it and so i may have another perspective on it but because of that feel that's why i love this pack so much and why i've gone back to this pack over and over uh, in my production as of late but here, here this last one and we'll bring it home Again, 
brings it all home. This one even has a kalimba in it. That is crazy. I and I heard it too. But this one, come on, it, it really drove the point home with the eternal vibes having that somewhat heavenly feel with the choir. That choir was on point and literally there's nothing can't say anything bad about that at all. That that sample is perfect. Perfect. If if this pack was uh was an album within itself, that sample is a perfect conclusion to what this pack is about and what it should sound like. And it even has that retro lead in as well. You kinda you heard it as well within you no know, in the sample. But yeah, I think this pack just allows you to get lost in you know the feel of it and when you're making beats from it you are able to you know you know possibly construct something that you know, as a person here here's that they can just mellow out relax and come back this is this is, you can create beats that people want to come back to over and over and over just to vibe out and just you know just relax from you know what i mean like it's it, it just has that feel for me. And that's why I've been coming back to it over and over. But, I mean, I get it. You guys hear these samples, and you guys are probably like, okay, cool, cool, cool. But what can you really do with it? Let's see if I can help out with that. Give me a moment. So as you see, I'm using stems for this one. I've actually gone in and actually uh, pitched the tempo up and I've changed the key. I've went up by 200 cents. And what I've done to make things easier in the case that I don't want to keep fiddling with the actual sample and stretching it to the tempo, I've gone into the mode of each stem and I've clicked stretched so that whenever you change the tempo, it'll still play in that tempo. So just a key thing. Yeah, so in case you want something different and you don't want to speed it up. So this is a quick tip for you guys. Okay, back to the beat. Okay, guys, sorry I didn't do that much talking while I was making a beat. Um, again, I'm working with stems. As you can see, all of these here are stems from the the pack. One thing that I will say when making beats like this, or at least for me, is when you're trying to drive feel or emotion um, throughout a track, is finding ways to dip stems in and out of tracks are very important. Um, I'm usually a sample-based guy. But I do enjoy the opportunity to be able to use stems and to uh, to to bounce things in and out. So a lot of times, for me, starting lower or starting with less things in the beginning of a track, as you can see here. Now I only have two of the stems. Well, I actually have three technically as the intro. Then I actually drop the vocals out here for uh, this first section, uh, first part of the first quote unquote section. Then bringing in uh, those vocals. Um, the drone lead and then finally for the hook part bringing in the reverse keys it kind of drives emotion upward um as you bring in more things of course if you want to do the opposite you will start with more doing less um and then kind of the same thing with the drums as well um i i have my you know my drums here my 
my my kicking snare here has again i brought in things that i want to drive more emotion drive more feel into the track i added more things um the only thing only place where it didn't happen is technically us uh, here i didn't add any open hi-hats for the first part of the hook but then i brought them in for the second part of the hook so yeah um so i did give you the tip about uh you know make sure the tempo and the tempo and the picture sample is correct even if you want to change you know change bpm throughout the process but yeah, a lot of times for me it's all about creating feeling creating feel is learning how to just manipulate the samples you know or bring them in and out um and then just sometimes even with the samples you may not want the full sample again i use the full vocals here but for the beginning part i just wanted this first part of the vocal for the beginning part let's just one more time here's the beginning So yeah, so you will hear this beat at the end of this video. However, guys, this is just a small sampling of what you can do with this pack. And again, I this is very, very simple for me. I would definitely like to go in and add more things, or even, even if I just use the composition alone, what I can do with it. So I know a lot of you guys are probably stems guys. So you guys guys probably take this and say, man, what is he doing? Like I can do so much more with it. Well, I would definitely like to see that. And you can do so by purchasing this pack, PillarMajunior.com. Again, PillarMajunior.com, that link is in the description below. Again, Eternal Vibes. And trust me, once you get your hands on this pack, you'll be coming back to this pack over and over and over. And again, this is just a, a small example of what you can do with this pack. Um, yeah, guys, I'm excited to see what you guys do with it. Again, my name is Ryan Little, producer, content creator, and fellow spokesman for Pillman Jr. Again, Eternal Vibes, PillmanJr.com. Go get that right now. Send us your work. I'm excited to hear it. And yeah, guys, much love. Enjoy this beat. And yeah, see y'all next time.